What's going on, guys? Okay. I got a couple of goodies that came in. Yeah. I got a few things I want to show you guys. I decided to do it this way instead of face forwarding myself this morning. Uh, I did do a video about my decluttering. And uh, I had got rid of a, quite a few things. It was about a bag full of stuff. It's, you know, you can see the video if you want. But I was telling y'all that my favorite products for now is my Apogee. I was on YouTube searching, well, surfing, and just watching a lot of people about what they don't like and what they do like. And um, I want to throw it out there that everybody has different types of hair, genetically speaking. If me and you got 3B, 3C hair, that still doesn't mean that what works for me going to work for you. Okay. And I finished the rest of that in a bit. In a, in a bit. I'm, I got something I want to say about that because I'm kind of pissed off. Okay. The, the Afro G deep, deep moisturizing shampoo. I don't think I've ever had this kind, but I ordered this online guys because they didn't have it in Sally's. So I had to order this one online and this is 16 full ounce. I can't wait to use it. I am going to revert my flat iron hair back to my curly state. It won't be today. I'm in my first week of flat iron. Um, it's doing pretty good. Yeah, it's doing pretty good. Um, I think I'm going to try to do two weeks of it and maybe this weekend coming up instead of be, I think, January 2019. I'll be washing my hair and going back, reverting it back to the curly state before I go back to work on the 7th. So I've been off, I'll be off from work 14 days. That's a good thing about working for the state in some state jobs, you know, some state. I didn't say all state, but some state jobs shut down during Christmas time and they give you two weeks off. So I'm thankful for that because I'm enjoying the hell out of it. But anyway, I got the Afro G and this is serious care and protection. I know Afro G's are good and it's got the pH uh, balance in here. So I'm quite sure that's gonna be very good for me. This right here came in, uh, I had to order this too. I decided I wanted to try to style and wrap mousse. Um, I don't know guys, it's that thermal style wrapping set, heat protection, non-sticky formula, long lasting shine and hold, and I'm very excited to use this Alpha G. I do have other mousses from different uh, companies, but maybe about four of them. But this is something new added to my collection. Cause like I told y'all, the first one I did, my decluttered Afro G is my favorite right now. It's just my favorite. I really wish they come out with a, a, a twisting cream. I'm hoping that'd be next. They, come, they need to come on out with a, a twisting cream. You know what I'm talking about? When you want to twist your hair or, or do a three, trend, three strand twist or whatever, I would love to see how that would come out. Now this come from the store. Uh, this is something new, rich. It's a moisture rich leave-in. And uh, now that right there, I showed you, that's a deep moisturizing shampoo. And I like that because it's moisturizing and it shampoos your hair. I'm quite sure I'm going to love it because like I say, my 3C, 3B, 3C type hair loves Afro G products. Okay. Loves it. I don't have no problem with it. Some people do, some don't to each his own. So I end up getting this right here. And I can't wait to try this too because I am going to use this. I'm hoping it, it says the tangle. I really hope it do. I don't think I'm going to have a problem with Like I say, when I washed my hair the last time for I flat iron, I told y'all on that video, when I washed my hair, my, Af my other Afro G products, I didn't have to use a detangler. The comb went straight through my hair. And I'm like, oh my God, that's the first. Out of all the stuff I got, that's the first. Then I got this from the Sally store and it's a curl definer. This is something I'm very interested in uh, trying out. It says definition of control, texture hair, anti-humidity formula. I need that. I hope it works. I think I'm going to do me a wash and go with this. Uh, curl definer. So we're going we gonna to try it and see if it's going to work, guys. I can't wait to use it. I can't wait. So this is my new Afro G products that I got in. Okay, guys. TheBomb.com <laughs> got my Affinity Pro in. Okay, yeah, I got my Affinity Pro in, guys. Oh my God. 
I'm going to tell y'all what happened to me. If you have time to listen, I'm going to try to do this quick, fast, in a hurry. This came from Target, okay? I got it from Target.com. They, I got it yesterday. The UPS man dropped it off to me yesterday because today is Saturday. I was going to do a video yesterday, but I knew I had some more products came in at the post office. I said, I just wait. Anywho, I was going to order this, this Finity. I'm going to take it out while I'm talking and running my damn mouth. This Finity I was going to order online on eBay, right? Okay. Which I did. I placed the order in on eBay. And, um... It was $35 free shipping and handling. Okay. Oh, I'm dropping stuff. And um, when I ordered it, they quickly took my money pretty damn fast. Okay. That means they quickly took my money fast. And, but then it said pay, you know, the next day pay, but not ship. I said, okay, sometime it take up to three days. No problem. Let's talk about this right quick. And I go back to that. I love this it's so light you can set it up or you can lay it down i've been wanting one of these guys for so freaking long i'm gonna tell you something about me i i don't like stand-up dryers anymore well the ones that you set on your table you know what i'm talking about them kind i gave that one to my daughter i've been had that dry for so long then i had one of these but it wasn't this kind i've been had her for 15 years y'all and she finally just got caught she got tired but the stand-up dryer I used it last weekend to dry my hair. Oh, God, I got to get this thing open. As you know, I took it out. The, oh, here we go. Because I took it out the box. Anywho, this is the... I'm going to go ahead and take everything out. Oh, wow. This is the hose. I don't see a whole lot of people talking about these doggone bonnet dryer guys. Lately, I have not been seeing people on YouTube. I'm talking... It's a lot of people, women, and talked about bonnet dryers. But if you go to the date of it, you ain't got that many talking about it. I'm going back old school. I don't know about y'all. Anyway, while I'm talking, I'm trying to fight to get this stuff out of here. The dryer that I had, the bonnet dryer I had, like I said, she got old. And I, I just went on and tossed her. And the one that stands up, I was trying to use that thing, guys. And every time I try to get up under it, it would flop over my head. And I got so mad, I said, I can't wait to get my... I said, no. Let me go on and order my Fenty, I, I, my Affinity uh, bonnet hair dryer, because I can't deal with this bullshit. So anyway, here is the hose. Okay. Got the hose right here. And uh, here's the bonnet that you're going to be putting on your head. So anyway, back to eBay. I was sitting up there waiting three days past. Paid but not shipped. Paid but not shipped. Paid but not shipped. The fourth day I went to the bank, I called the bank and told them I want my $35 back and my account. I filed a complaint against the seller. So she asked me, well, what did you, what happened? You know, did you get your product? I said, no, ma'am. I said, I don't think I'm going to get it. And I said, y'all need to be putting my $35 back in my account. She said, well, we're going to investigate. I said, y'all ain't going to investigate shit. Give me my $35 back. Okay. I want my money. Where I made my mistake at guys with eBay is that I did not look at the feedback on that dude. And I fucked up. Everybody was negative in his ass. I'm talking about negativity. I'm talking about poor customer service. People was paying for their products and stuff and never received them. Well, make a long story short, when I did tell the bank what happened, I guess they must have got in contact with the seller through PayPal. I did it that evening. I don't remember what day I did that evening. Tell me why my money hit the bank at 8 o'clock that morning. He going to send me an email saying, uh, a seller has refunded your money back into your account because see what happened was I emailed him and told him, look, I want my money back. You want, you're not going to send me my product. Give me my money. I'm clowning. Right. And, uh, I guess when I got hold to the bank, they must've went to PayPal and it scared the hell out of his ass. And I got my $35 back ASAP. So that $35 went toward target on getting this dryer. Okay. Cause I don't have time for bullshit. Don't play with my money. People ain't got that kind of money to be wasting. But anyway, this is the um, the bonnet. Snap that on there. Well, shit, I didn't snap it on there. Okay, here we go. I'm going to like this, guys. Oh, yes. You get a bonus with this from Target. I don't think everybody give you a brush, but you get a bonus. And, uh, oh, yeah. I could dry my hair with this. The bristles are very firm. 
I can dry my hair with this. If I don't want to use my blow dryer, I can get this and dry my hair. And don't you think I'm not going to play with it next time I blow dry my hair. And you also get some organ oil to come with it. I got some organ oil hydrating mask. I'm going to try this organ oil out, guys. I noticed a lot of people have been talking about organ oil lately. And apparently one and only organ oil must be coming a thing or been the thing. And I quit using it along many years ago and I think I'm going to start it back. I think I'm going to buy me another bottle of organ oil. So yeah, this came with it. That's your extra and the brush is your extra. So about the settings right quick. On here, you got your on and off switch. Okay. And then you got high, medium, low, cool. And, and I like that. That's what I want. See my other dryer of uh, my other bonnet that I had only had high and low, either low or high. You didn't get no cool. You didn't get nothing but high or low heat. She dried my hair. Don't get me wrong. I had it for many years, but I was just ready to go ahead and do me an upgrade. And this is it, guys. This is it. And uh, I can't wait. I cannot wait. I got about seven more packages coming in. I'm down. I didn't got everything I needed right now, but I still I'm still waiting on seven more packages. Um. I got something from Alta. Nothing that a lot of people probably would be interested in, but I got two NYX, um, was it lingerie lippies in? And they are so close to looking alike. I got kind of nervous about it because one is 05 and one's 06. And I said, damn, how the hell did I make that mistake? You probably can't see it. I don't think it's going to autofocus. I'm like, how the fuck did I make that mistake getting, um, Two lippies close together. I'm like shit now. Probably gonna co come back and I might the next time I do a video, I do a front face. But it's too early in the morning, guys. Shit. I can't be sitting up here with my hair all over my head, bunted on my head, looking all crazy at y'all. Give y'all something to talk about. I ain't got time for this shit. But I wanna say something right quick before I go. And I, I got to because I'm finna catch an attitude. I don't have that many subscribers guys okay i don't have very many okay we open it up let me show you what this look like i don't oh yes she's gonna work out just fine for me i already know it because with my skin tone i'm not gonna have no problem with her i already know i'm not okay this one is in i had to put some more light up y'all it's dark this is in 06 this one right here is in 05 oh yes baby lip liner honey we're gonna be all right these are nudes oh yeah that's gonna work oh yes shuck it shuck it now a lot of people don't don't it don't work out for a lot of people because of their skin tone but i already know i'm not gonna have no problem with this so yeah i got two of these lippies from nyx and it was on sale so with these two together i was only out of uh was it eight dollars ten dollars I think it was either eight or ten dollars they was on sale they had a clearance going on with uh at alta so that's how i ended up getting these but i want to go back to this right quick and then i'm gonna go because i got something to say about my afro g products and all my products when i decluttered and i had made a decluttering a decluttering video and i had one product on there that i didn't care for and that was the uh unjackies and i know this person is probably watching my videos and i've always looked up to him and thought he was the sweetest thing on youtube I'm not going to call his name out, but I'm a busting with myself. I don't have time for competition, okay? I don't get on here and compete against no damn body. I'm just a regular old country ass woman that's trying to keep some healthy ass hair and entertain. If y'all want to look at my damn videos and see what I got going on, that's fine. So I said something about this certain uh, product that I had. And I just said, I don't like it. It didn't work for me. I'm sorry. It just didn't work for me. It was funny that the next day this person made a video about the same product and was was kind of gashing kind of bashing about it not bashing the product but bashing like yeah you know come on come on come on this stuff is good and all this other stuff and i'm like is i wonder is he directing this shit toward me because i know he probably seen my video because it was just funny that you came back and made one about the same product i was talking about let me say something about fucking products okay i'm a 3b3c you might be a 3B, 3C. Anybody. Just because that shit worked for your damn head doesn't mean it's going to work for mine. Okay? I'm beginning to think that people on YouTube 
a lot of people are fake and full of shit. And a lot of times people push, push products out, especially when you're getting paid. They're pushing it out there to make that company look good and to make money off of it. I'm not stupid. I'm not making no money off of no goddamn body. I don't even have that many videos. I just do this. I have fun doing it. When I do it, I do it. I know I said on one of my other videos, I think I said, y'all not going to see me that much. Well, I fucking lied because I've been having too much fun these last two months. Okay. But it is going to stop. I am going to eventually slow down. Don't get me wrong. I'm going to slow down. But right now I'm just enjoying it myself. But I wanted to throw that out there. I'm not on here to compete against no damn body. I can't afford to keep up with the Joneses every time you put a product on YouTube and the fucking jar is 30, 40 fucking dollars. I ain't got the kind of money to go blow like that. I got some money and I spend my money the way I want to spend my money. You understand what I'm saying? But I'm not going to every time somebody puts something out there online. Oh, I got to go get it. I got to go get it. Got to go get it. No, I'm really trying to go back old school. Apple G has been around for a long time. And I want to say something. I'm going to talk about that on another video because I got to pull something out about my hair. And we'll talk about that on another video. But I got some stuff that's growing my hair just fine. And my hair is doing good. It's doing great. But all this bullshit, you look at my motherfucking video and then you turn around and come back with some bullshit. And you trying to throw that out at me. You know what I'm going to fucking do? I'm just going to block your ass. I don't have time for games and shit. Just because that shit didn't work for me and it's working for you. That don't mean it's going to work for me. It is what it is. Don't take that fuck. Don't take that shit personal. With a, with a, uh, what, they, what my dad used to say, a grain of salt. Don't do that. Because this shit ain't right. And I know when I'm feeling like I'm being insulted behind my motherfucking video. Because of something I said about a, a certain product. So, pull that bullshit again. Your ass finna be on block fucking list. And I don't give a fuck if you block me. Because there's too many people out there doing videos. That I really enjoy. There was one particular woman I love watching her. I love her videos. I love watching. I've been watching this woman shit, what, seven years now? Maybe eight. I don't know how long she's been on YouTube. She's around my age group. And I'm just going to say this right here. She's out of New York. I'm not going to call no names. She is so down to earth. She's cool. She's funny. And I'm going to tell you something. I love watching her. She ain't the only one I love watching. There's a lot of people I like watching. But she's just one of my far faves. So I'm going to end it on that note, guys. I hope you enjoyed my video. It is what it is. I love my Apple G products and what other products that I have that I showed y'all with my decluttering. And it is what it is. Do you. But I feel like people shouldn't add insult to injury on somebody else's video just because it's something they didn't like. Or oh, I'm a low YouTuber. You know, I'm very down. I'm very down there on the grade scale. I'm not trying to go out here and get big because I got a full time job. I put in 80 hours. I get a nice ass something, a nice ass check every month, but I ain't gonna take that nice check and blow it on hair products every time you throw something out there either. You see what I'm saying? Or anybody. I'm just not gonna do it. So I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna cut this video because I'm getting pissed off because I get, I, I will catch an attitude. I will catch one quick. I hope y'all enjoyed my products, guys. I can't wait to use my bonnet hair dryer and I will let y'all know how this little sucker, how this sister work. Target 30. She was twenty nine dollars. They had her. I think she's on sale. So I think I roughly paid between twenty nine and thirty five dollars, even if I'm not mistaken. So I think she's a good buy. I'm not going to encourage nobody to buy nothing I got. I'm just telling you what I like. If you want it, get it. Take a chance with it. But anyway, got to go. Bye, guys.